Hey, it's the Scotch Test Dummies. I'm Scott. I'm Bart. Pindare, and this is a single cask imported by Impex. They do some good stuff. Ex Tawny Port. Ex Tawny, it's a great one. I told them you got to take this one. I can't say all this because we're going to test it. Welsh single malt whiskey style. Ooh, you got a memory like a secret little box. <laughs> All right, we're coming in. So this is this, an so Impex import. They've been doing from, great. Yes, uh, from R&J R &J Discount Liquor here in Wichita. A great selection of world whiskeys. Yeah. They've been bringing in a lot of different countries uh, outside. Welsh. J. Oh, R&J Discount Liquor. Look at this. But anyway, Impex is an importer in the States. Right. Uh, they represent Glen uh Kilhoman. Hardback, no, no. Pendaren, no, no. but they're doing some, Impex is doing some hand select casks. I love Had it. some wonderful uh, Kilhomans and Glen Allocke. Feel free to Impex. pour yourself first, sir. Oh, I'm just... giving over that honor to you. Um, <laughs> interesting color on this one from that really? Tawny port. It's almost a pinkish rose wow. gold. You're right. Yeah, it's a little so, bit. So once you get it, I don't know if they can see it. Once you get in there, it looks normal, but it's got a little pinkish hue, a little pinkish hue to it like when there's a hue. So this is a single cask, eight years old. This is bottle number 249 of 304. Cask number was PT307. 58.8% ABV, 750 milliliters. I was going to say it tickled the nostril a little bit. And I thought it went a little too deep. I like the bottle style, the label. Oh, cool. and the uh, This looks military. Looks yeah, like yeah, that, yeah. It looks like that came out. Sprayed on your Yeah, they're like, mark rucksack. it. Mark it. Yeah, that's a rucksack. Hey, where's where's Private oh, Pendaren? Stencil. <laughs> yeah. Stencil. Where's lettering. Private Pendaren? Get out there. <laughs> Wouldn't be On the nose. Pendaren. Yeah. A little bit of a wine there, pass, okay. like the wine influence. There's a, a tangy. Yeah. A tangy kinda. grape juice almost. Yeah, okay. But maybe a little grapefruit as well. Do you get a citrus? Yeah, it's gonna, okay. Yeah, that's <laughs> it. A sour. It was just something different and sour, tangy. Yeah. Malty. Then, yeah, and the malts in the background. Grapefruit. That's interesting. Really kind of tart, sour fruits. Yeah, yeah. really interesting. That ex tawny port. Ooh, get you right on the right off the get go. Now, what's the difference between port and tawny port? Uh, tawny sounds better. Tawny oh, sounds but, amazing. And a definite, there is, I mean, if you, when it, when I was pouring it, you can notice yeah. it more, but it's, it's more of a pinkish type rose color wow. hue. Holy moly, a caramel finish. Caramel juicy grape finish. But it opens mm -hmm. up with this like effervescence and, and mouth coating mm -hmm. velvet. Mm -hmm. wow. um, grapefruit, limes. Lemon, really kind of tart, sour fruits in a good way. Mm -hmm. Caramel, burnt caramel. Yes. Ooh. A little spark across the tongue at that ABV. Slight, wow. slight cinnamon spiciness. Ooh. The spark got me on that one. <laughs> Actually, I didn't think it was too bad for 58.8. I know. I didn't on the first sip. There was nothing on the second sip. It, mm. it just danced. You want a little, uh, little water? Wow, I had to come in after that. Yeah, the citrus on the finish, the caramel, the burnt caramel. What else is there? Touches of vanilla honey. A lot of toasted notes. Toasted oak, toasted vanilla, toasted cinnamon, mm. toasted caramel. Run that tongue along Floral. your teeth. You get all the sweetness that comes right off of it. Nuttiness. Man, there's a lot of different things going on. I'm trying to think besides lemon, lime, Ooh. grapefruit. Sno knows it now. I'm getting butterscotch just oh, bubbling butterscotch. off. Butter butterscotch just blowing off the top here. Oh, um, wow. yeah. Wow. Yeah. yeah, that is was not there before. No, that's a good call. Holy moly. That is there with before the water. No. Now, butterscotch just fuming out of it. Goodness. Butter. Oh, wow. 
Yeah, I know that changed the nose up on, a lot. On marshmallow, butterscotch drizzle syrup on a marshmallow, toasted s'more. Yeah, with some spices sprinkled on top. Yeah. Cinnamon, nutmeg. That's a crazy nose. Ooh, the water opened the nose up. I got to know, did it do anything to the flavor? Anything? That was amazing change to the nose. We're starting to expand, yeah. 58.8% everything's kind of compressed in there. We're starting to expand. Nothing new coming out yet, but it's all just kind of, like I said, it's expanding. It's growing. Yeah, the nose was radically changed by the water. Strawberries, raspberries now, more Sweet. berry showing. Sweet berry is what I was mm -hmm. thinking. It's berry cream. Mm -hmm. Berry raspberries and, and blackberries, blueberries. Yes. Smothered in a sweet cream. Right. Almost I was thinking melted marshmallow. Melted with, with marshmallow. With berries. Yeah. Gosh. That is interesting. Mm. I don't know if I've used gosh. Gosh. <laughs> I don't think I've said that in years. Gosh. <laughs> mm. Mm. Man, that right. is really something. But now look as you now so oh, the, there's that, your pink. that pinkish rose color. Yeah, really showing now. It's got down a little bit in the glass. Hmm. <laughs> really neat. I don't know if I've noticed that in a whiskey before yeah, that a little more. color. That is getting Ooh. There's all those strawberries. Yeah. Oh my. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Yippers. Really. Nice. Wow, that just, the water is helping this evolve for mm. me. Bringing that ABV kind of dampening and opening at the same time. Mm. I know. Still yeah. butterscotch. Water really helping this one. It's even expanding. Now more toasted notes up front with that second drop of water. Mmm. I got a little graham cracker on the nose. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot. The nose is so much different than the taste, though. I get all those butterscotch and graham cracker, and then it's the berry cream. It's almost like you melted a marshmallow in a in a like a a, a cup, and then put berries and the juice in there, and it's somehow mixing with the marshmallow. Gosh, that again with the gosh, gosh, where's that coming from? <laughs> Mm. Wow, that is so different. Nice finish on this one. Really hanging on. Surprising for eight years old. Mm. <clears throat> yeah. Mm. Eight years old. It's eight wow. years. Impex, you guys are killing it. 750 milliliter, 58.8, eight years old. 58.8. You think they did that on purpose? Ooh. Ah. Ooh. An eight year that's 58.8. X Tawny Port single cask. Gosh knows I love again with the gosh. Ports, port finishes. I'd love to take this one on. Hmm. Ooh. Specially selected and imported by Ooh. Impex Beverage. Yes. Wow. A bit. I just put a third. This, I think water is really expanding this one. It really is. helping it. It, it was good. It was good, neat, but it's definitely better with water. Yes. I put, it, I put even put a third drop I on here. I saw it. I didn't even hesitate because I was like, who knows what's going to happen? All of a sudden, a magical dragon's going to fly out and say, Panarin. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Still mm. good. Still good. Really nothing uh, more showing itself, but one, two, even three drops of water. Very nice. Ooh. Mm. Tasty. Nice finish. Clings on. Man. There. I had. I don't know why my expectations were just kind of flatlined on this one. I thought, who knows? Eight year, I think. I was thinking, eh, eh, we'll see. Holy moly. I'm telling you right now, I don't even know the price. This is a 91. I'm loving what this thing is doing with the water. I would say it was good before, but then you started putting water in and it just like exploded. I'm at 92, so right there with Ooh. you, just, just above you. Uh, very nice, very good. Now, I think the story, though, here is this is a single cask. It's from Impex. Mm. But really, the story to me is if you see a, a Impex oh, God, they know single what cask doing. bottling, everything we've had from them oh. has been really good. Who's picking their barrels? We need to know. We It should be us. Oh, they need to like, well, but I, don't no, know. I don't know if I could do what they just did. We should look them up to see because I know Glen Allakey and Kill Homan, we've had Impex well, bottles at, from. It says... Uh, 
Vista Phillips, Vista. Master Blender. Master Blender. Uh, wow. Is it a Vista? A I S T A Phillips. Way to go. Because this. But this is a single malt. This isn't a blend. This right. is a Welsh single, single malt whiskey. What is going on? I think. I don't know. I think you're right. That's just unbelievable. Yeah, single, single malt Welsh whiskey. Yeah. It's just great, so, though. Find that. Um, How much? 130. I was hoping you were going to say 80. 90. <laughs> yeah, or 80. 130 is well worth it, though. That is a taste extravaganza that's going on. You know, though, I wonder, it could just be because we are in Kansas. Maybe they're cheaper elsewhere, but, you know, we've had Finland whiskey, Swedish whiskey. They're all running a little bit higher. Maybe that's some of the getting it to Kansas. Maybe. I don't know. Could just be that there's only 249 <laughs> bottles out of 304. Yeah. I mean, there's not a lot of this one to go around. And, uh, man, I am digging the fruits coming off of this. Yeah. Later, go. yeah. Very nice. Very good. But wow. I think it's worth it. It well. is worth it. So and you know I'm tight, baby. I'm tight. Getting that wallet open for me is a whole thing. Go to scotchtestdummies.com. You can pick up coins, glasses, dropper sets, shirts, hats, all kinds of stuff that helps support the show. And we bought this one with Patreon funds. You can go to Patreon, look up Scotch Test Dummies. You can go and support for as little as a dollar a month. Who can't afford a dollar a month? You can ratchet it up however you so choose from there. Please go check us out on Patreon Scotch Test Dummies. Scotch it. I can smell caramel. I know. I still good. got this aftertaste in here. You Scotch gods. Cilantro. Dummies. Dummies. <laughs> Woo. Mm, butterscotch. That is good. I know the butterscotch is pouring out mm. of there. That's what I...